on, guys. This will be my Nintendo DS collection. I, um, I've got a pile of systems. Let me just look up here before I actually start. How many games do I have in this collection? Um, basically, I started off just grabbing the ones that I really wanted to play. But um, <clears throat> with the way that they've been selling at garage sales, I, uh, I started kind of just grabbing everything if it's in half decent shape. So for the N Nintendo DS, I have 150, 148 games. So a little over 150 because I haven't added some to the database yet. Anyways, I'm going to get right into this. I have the, uh, starting off here with the systems, the metallic rose, uh, different than pink, which I recently learned. Um, what do they call this one? Cobalt and black, so it's blue with black bottom. That's the regular pink. Uh, metallic silver. This is the special edition. Um, it's kind of like a baby blue. Ice blue, they call it. Ice blue with brain age. Comes with a really cool case. This one's actually really hard to find. I have, it's the, I've only seen this once and I picked it up at a garage sale. Still looking for that kiwi uh, green cooking, um, what is it? It's a cooking version. I gotta move quicker than this. Uh, let me see. I got the Pokemon version, um, the black version, Pokemon Soul Silver and Heart Gold, I believe. Metallic silver. Here's the metallic silver. I don't have it in its box. Um, the black, just the regular black. Every single one of these uh, DS's were purchased mostly this past summer for at garage sales for an average of five bucks or so. So I, uh, I debated whether flipping them, but I kind of I like having each color variation, and for that price, I really can't pass them up. There's the pink. Here's the special edition black and silver Guitar Hero version. The uh, blue. Uh, Crimson Red comes with a really nice case. This is the first one I owned. This is my actual, uh, that was, actually I originally owned the white, but I traded quickly, and as soon as that came out, I traded up. Then there's the uh, ice blue. Let's see, I also have a white DSi. Um, there's the system there. Again, that was five bucks. Uh, this I purchased on my own. This is the 25th anniversary Mario um, DSi XL. Here's the box. Absolutely love this system. Um, probably even more so than the 3DS XL. I still love that textured back on it. Um, this, in my opinion, is one of the best handhelds ever made. Absolutely love it. And uh, before that, I had the, uh, the blue 3DS XL. Um, Club Nintendo picked up the Mario Luigi, Luigi Mario DS Lite holders. Pretty cool. And now on to the games. As I said, 150-ish games here. So I'm going to have to plow through these. I might mention one or two things about certain games. But for the most part, I will just be doing this quickly. Um, it's going to get a little awkward. There's games everywhere here. Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 Defiance. Not great games on the uh, DS. Uh, Call of Duty World at War. This one's Tom and Jerry Tales. There's one of those games that I just decided to keep. Uh, Mario vs. Donkey Kong 2 March of the Minis. Great games. Cooking Mama 2 Dinner with Friends. Promise they get better. Uh, Bomberman Land Touch. Namco Museum DS. Flash Focus, uh, Sonic Classic Collection, uh, one, two, three, Sonic and Knuckles, Personal Trainer Math, I actually enjoy these games, Drawn to Life, uh, Kirby Mass Attack, that's the uh, most recent one, really great game, as all the Kirby games are, um, Wacky Racers, Crash and Dash, Crosswords DS, good time waster there, Avatar of the Game, don't think it's very good. Um, Talk Mojo Mistake, I believe that was in the PS2 also. 
classic plants vs. zombies, must have. Animal Crossing Wild World. Uh, these are in no real particular order. The original Cooking Mama. Fantastic game here, underrated. Pokemon Conquest, a uh, kind of a hidden gem. Not a lot of people know about this. Great strategy RPG. And this is going to go through all the Pokemon stuff. Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Explorers of Darkness. Explorers of Time. Pokemon Ranger. Pearl. Uh, Soul Silver. And here's a box for Soul Silver with the Poke Walker. Diamond. Pokemon Platinum. Pokemon Black. Pokemon White. And the legendary Starfy, just that's recently picked up. Great game. Same as this, Golden Sun, Dark Dawn. Uh, Final Fantasy, Crystal Chronicles, Ring, Ring of, that's interesting, Ring of Fates. Not Rings of Fate, Ring of Fates. Um, Rhythm Heaven, classic game there, love that one. Okay, Sonic Rush. Um, Sonic Rush or Rush Adventure. I know the Rush Adventure games have RPG elements. Um, really fantastic. The Sonic games generally are pretty good on the uh, DS. Let's see, how am I doing for time here? Bad. Okay, Yoshi's Island DS. Mario 64 DS. Henry Hatsworth and the Puzzling Adventure. Absolute must buy. Fantastic game. Um, Professor Layton and the Diabolical Box. Um, Unwound Future, Professor Layton. Um, kind of an uncommon one here, Super Princess Peach. Good platformer. Um, new Super Mario Brothers, everybody's got that. Uh, kind of uncommon also is Tetris DS, surprisingly. Went out of print and uh, the license, or the licensing ran out. Let's see, two classics here, Castlevania, Order of Ecclesia, and Dawn of Sorrow. Um, probably one of my favorite uh, DS games, um, Retro Game Challenge. If you can find this, buy it. Um, these are the same guys that recently did the uh, Nintendo NES Remix. Fantastic game. Spin-off of, um, oh geez, Retro Game Center CX in Japan. Um, also, Wicked Television Series, go check that out. Uh, Super Robo Tyson OG Saga, fantastic, very Japanese Atlas title. WarioWare DIY. Mario and Luigi Bowser's Inside Story. Um, nine Persons, nine, or Nine Hours, Nine Persons, Nine Doors, 999, fantastic. Uh, the previous, or the uh, prequel to uh, Virtue's Last Reward on the 3DS. Uh, very odd game, Flower, Sun, and Rain. I think this is an ignition? No, maybe not. Exceed. Uh, must own here, Advanced Wars Dual Strike. I need the manual for that. Glory of Her uh, Hercules. A another Call of Duty Modern Warfare 4. Metal Slug 7, fantastic. Orcs and Elves, uh, classic RPG. This is the one that's, uh, no, this is like a dungeon crawler, old school. There's another one I was thinking of. That's uh, like um, Chrono Trigger. Harvest Moon DS. Blue Dragon Plus. That's by Ignition. Uh, Mega Man Zero Collection. Disgaea DS, great uh, strategy RPG. Uh, Nostalgia. Fire Emblem, um, Shadow Dragon. Fire Emblem games are amazing. Another must own here, Picross 3D. These games are fantastic. Uh, Turn It Around. Not sure why I have that. I think it's actually pretty bad. Next up, WarioWare Touched. Final Fantasy 3. Prince of Persia, The Fallen King. Metroid Prime Hunters. Infinite Space, I guy, I believe, yeah. Uh, SimCity DS. Uh, Mario and Luigi Partners in Time. Lunar Dragon Song. 
Um, fantastic game, Contact by Atlas. A lot of people kind of compare it to um, Earthbound. Um, the only real, well, the, the art style is quite similar. Or similar. Chrono Trigger DS, must own obviously. Brain Age, the original. Trace Memory. Uh, Shin Megami Tensei Devil Survivor. Front Mission. Uh, core. Budget Shooter. Um, first Person. DS. Not too bad. Uh, Game & Watch Collection 2. Uh, the Club Nintendo. Um, Game & Watch Collection 1. And... I could have sworn I had multiple copies of that. I guess. Mario Kart DS. Advance Wars Days of Ruin, Hotel Dusk, Room 215, fantastic game, kind of like a mystery novel, film noir kind of game, Moon, that's a good one, uh, another first person shooter, uh, From the Abyss, uh, Axis RPG, Geometry Wars Galaxy, fantastic game, not bad on DS, um, Space, uh, Space Invaders Extreme 2, really fun game. Transformers Cybertron Decepticons. Magical Star Sign, you see that a lot in a lot of budget bins. Bargain bins. Um, Mario Party DS. Chibi Robo Park Patrol. Chibi Robo game is really cool. Actually, I think they're coming out with a new one on the 3DS or the Wii U. Must own here, The World Ends With You. If you can find this, buy it. Locks Quest, another great game, kind of like a tower defense game. Black Sigil is the game I was referring to. It's a lot like uh, Chrono Trigger, kind of a very uh, retro RPG. Um, here are the Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney Trials and Tribulations, uh, Phoenix Wright Justice for All, um, the original Ace Attorney. Drop some here. Apollo Justice Ace Attorney. And Ace Attorney or Miles Edgeworth Miles Edgeworth Investigations. Uh, Star Wars Lego Star Wars a complete saga. Not bad on the DS. B movie, not sure why I have that again. Uh, Mario and Sonic the Olympic Games. Harry Potter, uh, Lego Harry Potter, years one to four. Trauma Center, Under the Knife 2. Touch the Dead. Uh, Legend of Cage 2. Uh, Legend of Zelda Phantom Hourglass. Uh, a lot of people hate on those games. Um, Spirit Tracks, I they're good. I mean, they're probably some of the worst Zeldas, but they're definitely worth playing. They're 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 not terrible. People love to hate on those. Um, yeah, there's my um, endorsement. They're not terrible. Final Fantasy Tactics A2 must own um, strategy RPG. Same strategy. Yeah, strategy RPG. Uh, Dragon Quest. Jeez, oh, I chapters of the chosen. My Roman numerals are terrible. Uh, Dragon Quest, Realms of Re uh, Revelation, and Dragon Quest, Sentinels of Starry Skies. Let's see, Kubi, uh, Kirby Superstar Ultra. I'm almost done here. I'm almost getting dry. Etrian Odyssey, the original. Uh, Wario, Master of Disguise. I'm running out of places to put these. Uh, Elibits, The Adventures of Kai and Zoe. Kai and Zero. Great game. Uh, Brain Age 2. Love these Brain Age games when they first came out. Tony Hawk's Proving Ground. Uh, Luminous Art 2. Another strategy RPG. Uh, Dragblade, Atlas title. Found that at a garage sale. I actually have never played this. Looks like it might be a fighting game. 
Uh, Aliens Infestation. Fantastic game. That's a must buy right there. You can find it at Walmart for dirt cheap. I think under 10 bucks easily. Uh, the Dark Spire. Look for this one for a long time. Old school dungeon crawler. That's a must buy. Radiant Historia. Another must buy. Uh, Hero Saga. Uh, Leviathan Tactics. Nintendogs, uh, Kirby Squeak Squad, Rune Factory 3, Rune Factory, the original, I don't have two I believe, no, uh, Ninja Gaiden, Dragon Sword, that was a great game, um, I actually really enjoy the next one on the 3DS too, uh, Suikoden Takri, Another strategy RPG, Assassin's Creed Altair's Chronicles. Almost done here. Inya, In, Inuyasha, Secret of the Divine Jewel. Um, probably one of my top five games on the DS. Uh, Might and Magic Clash of Heroes. This is on many other systems now, PC, 360. Um, fantastic game, RPG with puzzle type elements match three kind of system this buy this if you find it cheap or not even if it's not cheap buy it legacies of ease books one and two uh, mario hoops three on three uh, shrek super slam diddy kong racing ds really good uh, racing game mario kart type scooby-doo who's watching who uh, master of illusion Personal Trainer Cooking, surprisingly good, um, surprisingly good at training you how to cook. Um, yeah, it's good to flip it on and to walk you through the recipe, all the ingredients, you can bring it with you as a checklist, like grocery list kind of thing. I've never done it, but it'd be kind of cool. Rayman, Raving Rabbits TV, Party, uh, Scribble Knots, Viva Pinata Pocket Paradise, another underrated game there. Uh, Kingdom Hearts 358 over two days. Uh, Nintendogs, Dash Hound, and Friends. Okay, last couple here. Lego Batman, the video game. Uh, Lego Indiana Jones 2, The Adventure Continues. Uh, Lego Star Wars 2, the original trilogy. And the last one here is Mega Man ZX, or Mega Man Advent ZX. And that's it for my um, 3DS collection here, or my DS collection, sorry. Um, it's a constantly growing collection. The DS, it's a great time to buy, obviously. Um, you can find games pretty cheap, but I would suggest um, really seeking out those RPGs because they're only going to go up from here. So um, thanks for watching, guys. Feel free to like the video, comment, subscribe. Um, liking always helps me out. So. Uh, feel free to do that and check out the Facebook page. Thanks guys, later.